Hi my loves, happy Friday. I hope you all are doing fabulous. So today's video is going to be more of like a styling video, like a style inspo type of video. So lately I've been getting a lot of requests to do like a vacation lookbook, just a vacation style inspo type of video. And I wanted to kind of like break those kind of videos up. Today's video is going to be more of like a dressy vacation style video. So these are going to be the pieces that I would personally wear going out on vacation. So like going to dinner, going to a nice club, going to a nice little lounge bar, but basically pieces that I would wear for dressier occasions when on vacation. I don't know about y'all, but for me personally, when I go on vacation, the hardest thing for me to pack and to organize is my dressy looks. Like it's very easy for me to pack away like swimsuits and like cover ups and tank tops and shorts and like all the casual pieces. Like that's easy. I've gotten to a point now where I can technically pack dressy pieces that I know for a fact can be worn out but can also be worn very casually as well. So y'all already know me. I love to have like good universal pieces that can be worn multiple ways. So, so that is what today's video will be about. I hope all of that made sense. But today's video is basically going to be centered around the more dressier outfits that I would pack if I were going on vacation. Before we get into the video though, if you guys are new to my channel, hi, hello, my name is Brittany and I love to make videos about beauty, fashion, style, and all of that fun stuff. If you guys aren't already following me, make sure that you guys follow me over on my other social media platforms as well. So Instagram, Pinterest, and TikTok. Like I always say, I am most active over on Instagram. So definitely make sure you guys follow me over there. Most of the items that I have here are all items that I've had in my wardrobe for a while now. But if they are still in stock, of course, I would definitely try and find them and link them down below. But if not, I will definitely make sure to link similar items down below for you guys as well and then of course if you guys have any comments or questions please feel free to leave those down below all right my love so with that being said we'll go ahead and get right into the video so the first like tip that I would recommend if you are trying to pack more of your dressier looks for vacation is I would personally start with the accessories I am huge on accessories, jewelry, belts, hats, bags, like all of that fun stuff, especially when you're packing your nighttime looks. I feel like you can have a very simple and minimal outfit, but it's the accessories that will really make that outfit pop. So the hats, the bags, the shoes, all that kind of stuff. So I have a couple of accessories here that I just wanted to show you guys. So the first is going to be this little hat right here. I believe I got this hat from Pink Lily last year. It's just such a fun little hat. I really like this like tribal detail that is on the hat. This hat right here is giving me very much like Tulum vibes, Cabo vibes. I just really, really love hats like this, especially when I am going on vacation because there's something about a hat like this that I just feel like it just makes the outfit pop. You can also have like a good beach hat as well. Like you can definitely have a good raffia or straw hat but it's just something about like having a good wide brim hat like this that I feel like just makes the outfit pop. So another hat that I have is this hat right here. This hat I ended up getting from Lulu's about two years ago and it's from the brand Lack of Colors. They make a ton of hats that look like this and again it's just another wide brim hat and I just really love the detailing that is on this hat and yeah I just think that hats like this are just really fun and just really cool to bring on vacation with you. And as far as bags go I have three bags that I would personally bring on vacation if I were going on vacation tomorrow. So the first is going to be this little raffia little bucket bag right here from um, Marshalls. I ended up getting this almost like three months ago. It's still one of my favorite little summer beachy bags. I just really love the detailing of this. I love the little chain detailing but then I also love this like bamboo part of it and it just this bag screams summer. It screams vacation. It's really easy to wear. It actually comes with a strap as well and like I said I ended ended up getting this from Marshalls. Marshalls has a ton of bags like these so I would definitely link some of my favorite options down below but yeah just go into your local Marshalls. They have a ton of bags like these that I just feel like are so perfect to bring on vacation. With. Another bag that I think is really fun to bring on vacation is this little knotted bag right here from the brand Dolce Vita. I just really really love this bag. I love the detailing that's on it. It's just a good little like clutch bag and yeah it's just really easy to wear. I believe this bag also does come with a strap as well so you can definitely wear it crossbody but I just really love the strap option. It's nice and deep 
deep as well and if i'm not mistaken this bag also comes in a bunch of other colors it's a neutral color so of course whatever outfit you pack this bag is going to go with it and yeah i just love a little bag like this and the last bag that i feel like would be great to bring on vacation would be this bag right here it's just a clutch and i also believe this one comes with a strap as well i ended up getting this bag about two years ago from the brand beachy dolls and i still love this this bag just screams like beachy boho vacation and i love it it's just really loose you can fit a bunch of items in it yeah it's just a good little bag to bring on vacation with you so don't forget about the accessories when you are packing your more dressier outfits on vacation so moving right along to the clothing part all of these pieces i feel like can be dressed up or be dressed down which is what i love like like i said when i'm going on vacation the hardest thing for me to pack is my more dressier outfits but now i've gotten it down to a science to where as long as i have neutral pieces and as long as i have pieces that i know for a fact can be dressed up and dressed down i'm good to go so the first piece that we'll start off with they're going to be these wide leg pants i got these pants years ago from express and they're still one of my favorite wide leg pants to wear they're just really really loose they're very stretchy they're very comfortable they're just a true wide leg pant and as you guys can see these are the type of pants that can definitely be dressed up or dressed down i can wear this with like a cute little lace bodysuit going out or i can also wear this with like bando top or a t-shirt just kind of like walking around so as you guys know i'm a big fan of like wide leg pants flowy pants like this flowy trousers i just feel like they're so versatile you can wear them so many different ways and i would hands down pack these if I was going on vacation. So the top that I have with those pants is going to be this little lace bodysuit right here. I love this lace bodysuit. You guys have seen me talk about this many times. It's from Zara, which by the way, Zara is actually having a sale going on right now. So definitely check them out because they probably have a lot of really pretty pieces on there. I have this little lace bodysuit from Zara. It's still one of my favorites. I love to wear this piece. And this is one of those pieces that again, I can wear with the pants. I could wear it with shorts i can wear it with a skirt if i wanted to i can just wear this little bodysuit so many different ways and this is something that i would definitely pack in my suitcase if i were going on vacation just because you can never really go wrong with a lace bodysuit so if i'm getting ready at night and i'm like oh my god i don't know what to wear this right here automatically screams dressy it automatically screams like nice dinner so i really really love this little bodysuit i just think it's fun and i just feel like having one good like dressy top dressy bodysuit is definitely essential when going on vacation the next item that i would recommend if you are going on vacation would be to have a good staple black dress it doesn't matter if it's a long dress or a short dress but just having a good staple black dress you can just never go wrong with a good staple black dress so i have this one right here which you guys have seen so many times from the brand petal and puff i have a discount code with them i'll leave that down below but i am still in love with this little like slinky midi black dress i just i don't think i will ever get rid of this dress it's so versatile it has gone on so many different like vacations with me this is what it looks like on the hanger it kind of has this cow neck this is what the back of it looks like and then it just has this little slit that is on the side i love how versatile this dress is how lightweight it is and it's just a perfect little black dress to have when you are going on vacation it's easy to pack it's not going to take up too much room or too much space in your suitcase this again is one of those pieces that i can wear dressed up or I can throw on a pair of like just basic flat sandals with it and dress it down and walk around so so having a good little black dress would definitely be a vacation staple for me so the next little vacation outfit that I wanted to show you guys is going to be something that is still a little casual up top but more dressy at the bottom so when I do go on vacation like I said when I'm packing my nighttime looks I love to pack something that has a little sparkle to it a little shine a little shimmer and so I have this little sequin skirt right here that I thought would be so fun to bring on vacation I ended up getting this skirt about two years ago from the brand Lauren Nicole um, I'll link them down below this little skirt right here did come with a sequence top but I just love this skirt I've worn this skirt with like a denim top before a plain white button down a bodysuit i mean you can just truly never go wrong with a good sequin skirt i just feel like this is so fun to take on vacation with you especially if you plan on partying or going out or just having fun and i've gone ahead and paired that skirt with this little like bralette that i talked about last week this little bralette right here is from skims it's just truly one of my favorite favorite pieces it's so soft and then i also have it on with this just really sheer button down flowy shirt from Abercrombie. I feel like I got this shirt back in 2019.
2021. And again, it's just really flowy. It's really easy. It's really breathable. And the great thing about these two pieces is that these can definitely be worn casually on vacation. So you can wear this little top right here with like a really flowy maxi skirt to walk around in. You can wear it with bike shorts. And then of course you can wear something like this to walk around in as well. You can put these two pieces on together, wear them with bike shorts, wear them with like linen pants and just have a very casual look. Or like I said, you can definitely put it with something that's a little bit dressy as well. I love this little look. I just feel like this look is really fun and just really pretty to wear on vacation. So the next like little look that I wanted to show you guys is something that again, it's very simple. It's very easy to wear. It's monochrome. It's neutral. I just feel like these two pieces can be worn different ways. So the first piece is going to be this little corset top right here from the brand Joa Brown. I discovered this brand last year, last summer, and I just really love them. They are known for like more of their elevated basics and they are on the pricier side, but the quality of their pieces is really, really good. Very versatile. I just love their items. And so I have this little corset top right here, which is really, really soft. It's almost like a really soft elf material but I just love the detailing of this little corset top so 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 comfortable like this top is so soft and so comfortable and like I said because Joa Brown is known for making more elevated basics all of their stuff is going to be very comfortable but also very versatile but it's also a piece that can be dressed up or dressed down so this is something that I can put with the skirt I can put it with shorts I can dress it down I can put it with those pants and it's just a really easy top to wear so for size reference I ended up getting this top in a medium large I definitely pack that on vacation I would most likely also bring the black one as well just because it's so comfortable I would put that little top with this midi skirt right here I talked about this midi skirt a few videos back and again it's still one of my favorites this little knit midi skirt right here is from Beachy Dolls, I believe. And it's just so comfortable. It's so easy. It's neutral. This is just one of those pieces that just goes with everything. If I wanted to put this skirt right here with a t-shirt, I could. If I wanted to put it with like that lace bodysuit, I could. If I wanted to put it with that Skims little bralette. Like you can truly wear a midi skirt so many different ways. And that is what I love. That's why I will always love a good midi skirt on vacation. I feel like this look right here, paired with that detailed bag just gives it again a very easy like effortless vacation look and I'm here for it. All right my love so my last look is going to be something that is also very simple but I feel it's very fun to wear. So we'll first start off with these denim shorts. You have to definitely bring a pair of denim shorts on vacation with you. It's a must. But I have these denim shorts right here from Abercrombie. I got these about a month and a half, two months ago, whenever they were having their short sale is when I ended up getting these. I still love these. These are going to be from the Curb Love Collection, but these are the four inch mom high rise shorts. Um, I have them in a size 28 and they're super comfortable and I just, I really, really love these shorts. But I would definitely pack a pair of denim shorts on vacation and to kind of like jazz this outfit up, I would put it with like a really pretty crochet top. So I forgot that I had this bodysuit right here from Beachy Dolls that I've had for almost two years now. But I love this. First of all, I also feel like Anything that's crochet, definitely bring on vacation with you. Like crochet automatically screams like beachy vibes anyway. So definitely bring that. I have this little like crochet bodysuit right here that I just adore. I just think that this is so pretty. This is something that I would definitely bring on vacation with me. It could be paired with those pants. It could be paired with the shorts. It could be paired with that skirt if I wanted to wear it with the skirt. Like I said, I did end up getting this almost two years ago. So of course I will try and link something similar down below. And I just really, really love this look together. I think it's pretty. I think it's fun, but I think it's still like somewhat casual. Um, I love a good denim look in general. So I just feel like this last look is perfect to bring on vacation. With. All right, my love. So that is it. Those are going to be my five dressy vacation looks. I feel like all these pieces can be worn so many different ways. They can be mixed and matched with one another. They can be dressed up. They can be dressed down. I just live for just good simple pieces like this. So I just hope that that gives you a little bit of inspo if you are also going on vacation. All right my love so with that being said I hope you all have a relaxing weekend and a fun Friday. I love you and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye my loves.